Wall Street is being occupied and before we can start doing those things. But essentially what this whole meeting is for, and I totally appreciate your point, that's why we're all here, we can talk in small groups about that, but we need to talk about the decision-making process. And that's why we're all here. Let's not, like, stray from that, because it's going to be a shit show. <laughs> Okay, so the agenda is we're going to review the decision process that we have, and then we're going to talk about people's concerns with that. Those are the two things that we're going to talk about. Is that established? Are there questions about what we're talking about? I think there might be an update from people who've been talking to police. I think there might be an update from people who are talking to the police as well. Police lead us on. Alright, well, I'm going to read off the agenda. I'm going to read off the agenda. I'm going to read off the agenda. I was just confused because I thought we had a facilitator, and now we have another one. I'm just trying to pass the around. It's all good. We're 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 all adults. We can all handle ourselves. Yeah. Cool. So we want to start with the agenda. First, do we have an update from the police liaison team? Do we have an update from the police liaison team? Do we have an update from the police liaison team? I don't think they're here yet. Yeah, I don't think they're back. Process. What up, dude? How was that talking about the agenda? That was the first thing on the agenda. The was to talk about our decision-making process. Yeah, but at the same... No, no, no. Wait, you let me talk for a second, dude? Relax. The first person came up and said there was a meeting about the police liaison team talking to the Portland Marathon people. So we decided that if everybody's going to be in one group, we could talk about these things at the same time. Which would be pretty effective. I don't know. I think so. There are two meetings scheduled at one time. That's why. We're good, dude. Don't worry about it. Get a quick update and then you can move into Excuse me. Um, so that's great news. So that's great news. 
We have a couple other things that we also information we want to share. We have a couple other pieces of information we want to share. <laughs> Sorry. 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 So first, we're going to review what was uh, shared with us at the marathon meeting. So first, we're going to review what was shared with us at the marathon meeting. Next, there will be some police updates. Next, there will be some police updates. And finally, the folks who were in the meeting are just going to give a little bit of an accountability process. The folks who were in the meeting are going to give a little bit of an accountability process. Because we're, we're, we're striving towards democracy. And we want everybody to know who was there and why they were there. And we want everybody to know who was there and why they were there. And if there are any questions about that. And if there are any questions about that. And whether that's compatible with our democracy. And whether that's compatible with our democracy. We should talk about it. We should talk about it. So first. So first. Uh, updates from the meeting with the marathon committee. Updates from the meeting with the marathon committee. We were told, we were told, and given, and given, information, information, about the best, about the best, and most respectful, and most respectful, way, way, to continue occupying this square, to continue occupying this square. That information, that information, will give it, be given to, will be given to, in two seconds, in two seconds. We were also told, we were also told, by the two representatives, by the two representatives, of the Portland Marathon Committee, of the Portland Marathon Committee, that it is their preference, that it is their preference, that we leave the square, that we leave the square, and I think it's important, and I think it's important, that everybody knows that, that everybody knows that, because in our proposal, because in our proposal, earlier this morning, earlier this morning, we all agree. We all agree that was in our interest. That it was in our interest to work with the marathon committee. To work with the marathon committee. That being said. That being said. I'm going to hand over the mic. I'm going to hand over the mic to someone. To someone who's going to list all of the things. Who's going to list all of the things that will make our stay. That will make our stay here. Here. Maybe a little uncomfortable. Maybe a little uncomfortable. But, but accommodating, accommodating to the marathon. To the marathon. Hi guys. Hi guys. Okay, great. Okay, grab the mic check. Love the mic check. Okay, to start off with information about the marathon. This entire area that we are occupying. This entire area that we are occupying. In addition to surrounding blocks. In addition to surrounding blocks. Will be completely overrun by marathon activities. Will be completely overrun by marathon activities. The area that we are in specifically. The area that we are in specifically. These three parks. These three parks make up a red zone. Make up a red zone that has traditionally been a secure space. That has traditionally been a secure space where badges are needed to gain access. Where badges are needed to gain access. This is something that is a part of the Portland Marathon Protocol because they are a certified race. This is something that is part of the Portland Marathon Protocol. This security protocol with the red zone. This security protocol with the red zone is a part of their protocol. <laughs> is a part of their protocol for the race. For the race. So, as far as information for the race, we're looking at. As far as information for the race, we're looking at. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. Fourteen thousand participants. Fourteen thousand participants. Five thousand volunteers. Five thousand volunteers. In addition to all the people coming to see the race. In addition to all the people coming to see the race. Twenty to thirty thousand estimated. Twenty to thirty thousand estimated. The entire the red zone area. The red zone area is generally fenced and blocked off. Is with generally fenced and blocked off with black curtains. With black curtains and chain link fence. And chain link fence. The proposal to stay in the space. The proposal to stay in the space 
would be a part of would be a part of staying inside that secure space. Staying inside that secure space. We've been offered up one entrance. We've been offered up one entrance where we would need where we would need where we would need an escort back and forth back and forth to maintain the secure space. To maintain the secure space for just Sunday. For just Sunday. The context for that. The context for that is the race. Is the race and maintaining the integrity and maintaining the integrity of the race of the race. So there. Mike check. Mike check. How does that happen? How does that happen? What does the security mean? What does the security mean? I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna go ahead and finish running through the information that we gathered. And we can go ahead and answer questions. information that we got. Oh, sorry. I'm going to finish. I'm going to finish. Going through the information. Going through the information. That we gathered. That we gathered. And then we can address questions at the end. And then we can address questions at the end. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so in the process of setting up. In the process of setting up. There will be forklifts. There will be forklifts. Trucks. Trucks. Major machinery. Major machinery. Activities will be starting early Saturday. Activities will be starting early Saturday. Going to late Sunday. Going to late Sunday. Can you tell us that the area is bigger than just the it's actually like nine A quick clarification. A quick clarification. Area. The secure area goes beyond these parks. Goes beyond these parks. It is about nine blocks square. It is about nine blocks square. You can see I've, I had I passed some of these around. So if you want to look, there there are maps. There are maps of the course. Of the course. Floating around. Floating around. Floating around. Floating around. Floating around. I think there might be maps. Where? But are they floating? <laughs> As far as outreach goes, as far as outreach goes, we have the support of the we have, we have the support of the Portland Marathon. Portland Marathon to have outreach to have, have outreach away from the finish line. Away, away from, from the, the finish, finish line. line. The finish line is right there. The finish line is right there. <laughs> there, sorry. <laughs> Horrible direction. In the intersection, you can't see your hand. In front of the justice center. Right in front of the Justice Center, right across there. Right in front of the Justice Center, right across there. Towards the white tent. Towards the white tent. So to give folks an idea. So to give folks an idea of what this weekend could look like. Of what this weekend could look like. Well, I want you to close your eyes. I want you to close your eyes. And imagine. And imagine. This entire square. This entire square. Surrounded by. Surrounded by. A chain link fence. A chain link fence. With black curtains. With black curtains. With one exit. With one exit. With a bathroom. With a bathroom. But this is what. But this is what. In order to accommodate. In order to accommodate the Portland Marathon. The Portland Marathon. We would be staying in. We would be staying in for less than 24 hours. For less than 24 hours. This is a picture. This is a picture. I hope folks can understand. Or we are we are organizing towards. We are organizing towards. If we choose. If we choose to stay. To stay. Additionally, additionally, tomorrow, tomorrow, there will be, there will be, forklifts, forklifts, big machines, big machines, dangerous things, dangerous things. So be careful. So be careful.